is the idea of sin made up by men in order to control other people. Well, recently a popular YouTuber called Repsion put out a video uh, describing why he left the Southern Baptist Church, and in it he says this. But that's the whole self-blame aspect of religion, because sin being that man-made concept, it really just tries to control you and to make you feel bad for everything that would be considered natural in the day-to-day -day secular world. Now the question is, okay, is sin made up by men in order to control other people? Well, I would say no, and the reason being is we all have a conscience that convicts us of what is right and what is wrong. You don't have to believe in God to know that you have a conscience, that you have an intrinsic sense of morality. And I believe that is God's law that he has written on our hearts. When we do something wrong or contrary to God's character, the Bible calls that sin. So everyone believes in sin, but they might just call it something else. They might just say doing something bad or doing something wrong. Well, the Bible has a term to use for it. And further on his video, the guilt we feel when we do something wrong isn't merely a result of religious indoctrination, but rather it is our conscience crying out to us that we are in trouble. You see, the scripture goes on to say that we are all in bondage to sin and unable to break free on on our own. Sin is not a made up idea in order to control men. Rather, we are all in bondage to sin. Now the real question is, how do we break free from this sin? Well, we need to look to the only person that did it himself, that is Jesus Christ. Jesus came to this earth fully God and fully man without sin. He lived the sinless life that we could not live and he died on the cross, the death we deserve to die for our sins against God. And he rose again on the third day, defeating sin and death. And what he calls us to do today is place our faith in him. When we do that, we are released from the bondage of sin and death and have a new identity in Christ. We are made into a new creation in him. And all of that is a result of God's grace. You see, while some might propagate the idea that sin is just a made up concept, that it just tries to shame us for doing things that would normally be natural and good. We need to recognize that not everything that feels natural is good. Because of the fall because of Adam and Eve's sin, we all have a sin nature, which means that we are uh, pulled towards the things that are not good. We are pulled towards sin and doing things that are wrong. And that's why we need Jesus to free us from that, to give us a new heart with new desires. In him, he has provided freedom from the power and penalty of sin. And one day he will deliver us from the presence of sin. Thank you so much for watching, guys. If you're new to this channel, my name is Isaac David, and this is The Daily disciple where I help you follow Jesus daily. If you enjoyed this video, subscribe because I'm putting out new videos every single day. It's pretty crazy, but it's only possible uh, by the support and uh, giving of those on Patreon, those people that are supporting my mission of helping people follow Jesus daily. If you want to get on that mission, if you want to help me do what I do and fulfill this calling that God has laid on my life, I would encourage you to head to the link in my description and uh, sign up on Patreon to give monthly. Thank you so much, guys. And I will see you next time. God bless.